Good evening. I'm Jennifer Lee. I'm Keith Kate. Thank you for joining us tonight. First tonight, a historic Zika warning. Pregnant women told not to travel to a popular Miami area. And if you've been there and you're trying to get pregnant, you might want to change your plans. That's how serious it is right now. Couples trying for a baby who have traveled to this arts district in Miami are being told to abstain from sex for at least six months. Incredible, really. This after 15 people in that one neighborhood tested positive for Zika. So is it just a matter of time before that begins to happen here? Melanie Michael is live for us tonight. Mel, such a compelling story. We've been talking, in the, talking about it in the newsroom all evening. We certainly have. Good evening to you both. A very serious warning indeed tonight for women and their partners who have traveled to that area of Miami and want to get pregnant. They should wait. Historic and unprecedented. The pregnancy warning being heard loud and clear around the U.S. Do not have sex. Do not try to get pregnant if you've been in the popular Wynwood Arts District in Miami, where the Zika toll now stands at 15. There's concern the virus cannot be contained. Coming from a pregnant woman who deals with it every day. And, and Dr. Mary Ashley Kane knows better than anyone else how scary this is. She's not only an obstetrician, but she's also seven and a half months pregnant. I don't recommend you to travel to those areas. That it's really not recommended during pregnancy. When it comes to sex, Dr. Kane gives this advice to her pregnant patients and their partners who have traveled to a Zika zone. If your partner has been, has traveled to one of those areas and you're currently pregnant, then the choices are abstain or um, use protection throughout the remainder of the pregnancy. Research experts tell Aid on Your Side it's only a matter of time before the transmission area spreads to Tampa Bay, and here's how it would work. Once bitten and infected, the person traveling from the Zika hot zone elsewhere can then be bitten by another mosquito. Then that infected mosquito bites someone else. Some pretty scary stuff tonight. So the message here, if you've been to that area in Miami or another Zika zone, if you're a man and you're trying to get your wife pregnant, well, you should wait up to six months. And if you're a woman, you should wait for two months. So couples trying to have a baby, couples who have babies, Jen, it is a very serious situation. Well, here's what's really scary for folks who maybe were vacationing in South Florida a month, two, three months ago. What about women who may not have known they were pregnant then when they visited that area? And that is indeed a big concern. A lot of folks talking about that right now. Those women are being tested for Zika now. Wow. More to come on this. Melanie Michael, live in Tampa Force tonight. Thank you, Mel. And there is a lot to know about the Zika virus. Eight on Your Side wants to help you separate all the facts from the fiction. You can find out more by logging on to WFLA.com.